Welcome back to Google Guru. Today I'm going to show you a way that you can get experimental features for your Chrome browser. So if you feel like you're ready for some advanced features in your Chrome browser, then you might want to check this out. So I'm going to open up a new tab, and then at the top of my browser I'm going to search Chrome colon backslash backslash flags. So that brings up the experimental features page of your Chrome browser. So this is a list of a bunch of features that are not quite ready for the wide release of Chrome. So Google doesn't give any guarantees with how much they may work or if they will fail or break, but there are still some really exciting features that you can use. I'm not going to get into all of them right now, but if you feel comfortable using some experimental features, then you might want to just scroll through this page and see what you might be interested in. I'm just going to enable one of these just to show you a little bit of what you can expect. So, so if I scroll down here to this portion that says stack tabs, you can see that it says tabs never shrink. Instead, they stack on top of each other when there is not enough space. So I'm going to open up this other window that I have. So as you can see here with this Chrome browser, I have a bunch of open tabs here. So if I add another tab, all that happens is these tabs just shrink a little bit. But let's take a look and see what happens when I enable this experimental feature. So I'm going to click Enable, and then I'm going to have to relaunch Chrome. So after Chrome relaunches, I'm going to open up that other browser. And as you can see, I have all these tabs still open, but if I open up a new tab, they start to stack on top of each other rather than just shrink. So the tabs hit a certain point where they're not going to get any smaller, and then they just start stacking on top of each other. So this is just a cool little addition that you can add to your Chrome browser. It's it's certainly not a groundbreaking feature by any means, but it's still a pretty cool feature that some people might enjoy. So that was just a little bit of an introduction to the experimental features page of your Chrome browser. If you have any questions, please leave us a comment in the section below the video. Thanks.